So today's video is a review of my Costco diamond jewelry. I have three pieces to share with you today. The first being my engagement ring, which I actually did a video on that prior, and as well as two pairs of earrings. Um, both of those earrings were wedding gifts for my husband on our wedding day, and I actually wore one of those earrings for my wedding day. So I think it photographed really well, and I'd highly recommend that piece. Every diamond piece you buy from Costco includes an article of description. The clarity of Costco diamonds are always VS2 or greater, and the color is always I or greater. So at least you're going to get that standard of quality from Costco. So here we have a 14 karat white gold and diamond cluster earrings. Each earring is set with one round brilliant cut diamond weighing approximately 0.14 carats, surrounded by six smaller round brilliant cut diamonds. The total diamond weight of the earrings is 1.25 carats, so I'm currently wearing the larger earrings right here. So these earrings retail for $1,800, which is not too bad considering that you get a total carat count of 1.25 carats. Next we have a 14 carat white gold and diamond floral earring. Each earring is set with 11 round brilliant cut diamonds. The total diamond weight of the earrings is 0.45 carats or greater. So I actually wear these earrings on a daily basis because they're nice and small and I don't feel them. And I also like the fact that they are kind of flat so they don't stick out on your ear. So when you're sleeping at night, you don't have like this big diamond stud kind of poking into you. So I really like that about these earrings. These earrings retail for $6.50 and we purchased them in store. I'm not sure if we still have them online. I'll try to find them online. Um, but yeah, definitely check out your local Costco if you're interested. I got these somewhat recently um, within the past year or so, so they may still have it. Next we have a 14 karat white gold and diamond ring. The ring is set with two round brilliant cut diamonds, each weighing approximately 0.48 carats and 54 smaller round brilliant cut diamonds. The total diamond weight is 1.5 carats or greater. So this ring retails for $3,400 and you can reference my previous video on this ring as well if you want more information on that. But my husband actually picked it up for me in Portland, Oregon where they don't have sales tax so he was able to save even more. So this is actually my second wedding ring. Um, my first wedding ring is actually a Tiffany ring which I also have a video on that as well if you're interested. So here's a size comparison between these two. Now your Costco earring or ring purchase will come in one of these boxes. So this is the protective outer layer. And inside is your standard mahogany brown toned wooden jewelry box. So I actually have three of these boxes because both my ring and both pairs of earrings came in one of these boxes. And yeah, it would just look like this. And of course, also in that yellow box would be the article of description as I showed you previously. Now the Costco jewelry boxes differ quite a bit in comparison to the Tiffany jewelry boxes. You can see the Tiffany one is a nice suede material. It's much smaller in fact, and the hinge is a lot smoother right here. So yeah, altogether the Tiffany box is much more compact and easy to hold. There's no jagged edges. Um, as of recently, the past year, Tiffany has rebranded their jewelry boxes to become this iconic Tiffany blue color. And right now we just have a push closure that will open up your box like such. And here's the Costco box in comparison. Honestly, I think the packaging is kind of cheap for Costco. I know it's Costco and you are trying to save a buck. However, I mean, this situation is just not that classy if you're trying to give someone a gift because my box is already broken right here, as you can see. And yeah, it's very cheaply made. And this box, if you look on the bottom, it actually says made in China. Not surprisingly. So yeah, I would say that is one drawback to purchasing jewelry from Costco and that the presentation is not the greatest. 